of logarithms is uh, from two uh, chapter and uh, is one of the areas we have wanted to give light on and we are very thankful that you have chosen to uh, learn with us and so we get directly into handling uh, this area just as we have been handling other areas uh, in the time past now in this uh, uh, part we wanted just to go straight to some examples so that we may you know take you through some areas and some procedures i believe you need to uh, know them so possibly you may not have um, gone through them we get to teach you see how we do it or possibly you went through them and somewhere along the line you forgot some of these things so here we are here to help you uh, revise uh, even as you wait for your exams now in the first example we have here, we say use logarithms to evaluate the following correct to four significant figures. And we have 0 0.186 times 7.79. We are dividing with uh, three, uh, 34.2 times 0 0.0042. Now, uh, method what you do in this case, you, let's solve this one here. We have three columns, and have uh, a column for the number, the, the standard uh, form, and then we have the logarithm. Now, <clears throat> the first part is the first number is zero point one eight six. So it's here. So we write it in standard form. It shall be one point eight six times 10 power 1 all right and power negative should be negative 1 and so the logarithm uh, for that should be by 1 point and then we check now this out in the uh, log logarithm of number stables so it's 1.86 so we have 1.86 you can check it out in your uh, logarithm table you have 0. 2695. So this is by 1.2695. That's how you put it. Uh, 1.86. 0.2695. So it becomes by 1.2695. Now the second number here is 7.79. So the standard form for this one should be 7.79 times 10 power 0. So this is a 0. Place it there. So you go to logarithm uh, tables and get 7.79 and this is giving us 7.79 is 0 0.8915 0 0.8915 and since this is multiplication so here we do add we do addition so let's add we have this one is 5 plus 5 0 uh, this is 10 0 <clears throat> this is 10 1 okay this is 15 so we have uh, 16 mm -hmm. we have 16 uh, carry 1 this is 10 11 11 yeah we carry 1 okay so this is bar 1 that means negative 1 remember we are carrying 1 what, negative 1 we add the one we are carrying so that it becomes 0 it's bar 1 it's negative 1 plus 1 we get 0 0 plus 0, we get 0. So that is that. Now for the other part, 34, the other number is 34.2. The standard form for this one is uh, 3.42 times 10 power positive 1. Because it's a, a larger number. So you have this one here, you have 1 point. So you get... The variety of numbers 3.42 and we have uh, 0 0.5340 0 0.5340 and then next is uh, this one here yeah? 0 0.0042 so we have 4.2 times 10 power this, this one is negative 3 so this becomes bar 3 point 
bar three. Okay, this is it's not a point. It should be just. Now well, there's a problem here. We we'll get this one wrong. Yeah, this one should be bar one point. Um, I say three point four two. Five three four zero. So it's one point five three four zero. That's our correction there. Five three four zero. True. Then for this one, let's just go to four point two zero. We get uh, zero point sixty two thirty two six two three two. Yeah. So and this is this is our multiplication. We add them together, and this we are getting two. Seven, five, eleven. Okay, eleven. We are carrying one. Add this one here. Positive two, and then positive two minus three. We shall get bar, bar one. And since now we are dividing this one and this one, we take this value and this value and subtract them. So I'll have them here. I'll have the take this one here. Zero point. One six one zero. I'm gonna subtract this one by one point one five seven two because it's a, it's a division. We are dividing this is the numerator, this is the denominator. We are dividing the two, so in the logarithm, we subtract them. So let's see. So we shall have this as two. All right, so uh, we borrow one here 10. No, no. Uh, this is should be eight. Okay, so this here we have uh, zero. Borrow one here, yeah. ten minus seven. This is three. So we have this is five minus five zero, and this is zero. So this one we shall have zero minus negative one. So that makes it a positive one. We have a zero, a minus, and a minus gives us a positive. So this is the value we have here and so we can now check uh, for the, uh, the, the, the the hand log so for the hand log this one shall be times 10 power positive 1 and then we now go to the hand logarithms and check the hand logarithm of 0 0.0038 the hand logarithm can you focus on we can have the hand logarithm of 0 0.3 0 0.0038 from our table so we go to our logarithm this positive here we have here 10 power 1 so we check for 0 0.0038 so 0 0.0382 so we have 1.009 so this one is 1.009 so times 10 power 1 and we shall have our answer is 10.09. Shall have our answer as 10.09. So that is it. Okay, that is it, and that is how you go about it. You express the numbers in standard form first, and then go get get the, the logarithms. Add this part here, and also uh, for the uh, denominator, express it as in standard form get the logarithms add them now this value and this value subtract the two get this value check the and the logarithms and you have your answer thank you let's take other examples